explain the the process when someone calls you up mm-hmm. to inquire about you being their family medicine physician what happens next? Well, so a lot of people may be familiar with the term concierge care, and it's very similar to that, but we like to say, but without the sticker shock. Um, We don't process insurance at Mm -hmm. all. Concierge doctors may still be processing insurance. Um, But basically, the value that you get is you get appointments the same day or the next day. I'll do home visits if it's necessary, or we can meet after hours. Uh, Video chats, phone calls, text messages, emails. There's no additional uh, co-pays every time you reach out to me. Uh, visits are not rushed. Most of my visits are at least an hour long. Um, and then I actually have more time to, you know, continue my own education, find resources, community mm-hmm. resources that could benefit. And basically what DPC is doing, it's a nationally growing uh, movement because we realize that patients aren't going to the doctors because it's inconvenient, it's costly and impersonal. Mm-hmm. And it's so complex. You know, the recent Medicare uh, guidelines came out and they were 2,700 pages long, but uh, I kind of explained my business model in a trifold brochure. So mm-hmm. that that's kind of the basic of it. And we do want people to have insurance. I don't want, to, I want to kind of clarify that because there's certain yes. things that obviously a primary care physician can't handle. Mm-hmm. Uh, but, but there's other ways around to find insurance models or a catastrophic wraparound plan um, and, and still use our services.